For the last four years, Steve, every day of my life, I've woke up with him accusing me. For uh, four years? For four years. And every day, it was, if my phone rang, is that your boyfriend? Um, so was it? No, <laughs> obviously not, or I wouldn't still be with him. Why would I keep him? I could just send him down the road and have my so-called boyfriend there, you know? And um, so, I mean, it just has gotten to where the point where I can't take it no more. Like, one more time he accuses me, I'm going to strangle him. <laughs> so you're here to prove that you have been cheating? Exactly. Do you think he's cheating? I mean, the girl has told me before that he was, and so I've... I've assumed because he, the accuser is usually the one doing it, you know. Um, how long have you been married? We've been married for four years. and So he's accused you the day after you got married? No, well, we've been married for a year now. We got married December oh, okay. 18th. But, but you've been, been together, together for four years. We got together right after I separated from my spouse that I had went to confront about some stuff with my children. And he was found dead the next day, and everyone was calling me a murderer because of it. They think you killed your ex-husband. They think I killed my ex-husband. Did and you? No, sir. Okay. So they think I killed him, and Joseph, when he gets mad, he accuses me of killing him. I'm Because I'm like, I'm going to kill you if you accuse me of cheating again, you know, just hypothetically <laughs> speaking. And he, Which he's, might not be the smartest thing to say. <laughs> and he, he's like, he's like. He gets nervous when you say that. He's right? like, oh, like you did your first husband? Oh, because people in our town, or we live in a small town, think that I killed my first husband. So I'm here to prove that as well. Maybe I just want to know the truth about us. And I love you with all my heart. I love you so much. I love you. I want to know the truth, too. <laughs> you believe that she cheated on you? Yes, sir. Why do you stay? I just stay because she's a look at her. She's she's gorgeous. She's a you can't stay with me nice. because I'm gorgeous. She's, it's like I know, I know. you gotta like she's, something about me. She's she sparkles and makes me just. Do you just ever get me. nervous when she's holding a kitchen knife or? Yeah, I'm getting nervous right now. Steve. <laughs> I'm getting nervous, real nervous, Steve. You don't have a big life insurance policy on you, do you? Oh uh, no, sir. Okay, that's no, probably sir. good. Um, no, but I'm joking around, but you don't believe that she killed her ex-husband, right? Uh, no, sir, I, I was, uh... <laughs> He's accused me a I lot, have, Steve. Every day her. I get accused of, of, of cheating every day of my life. He wakes up in the back of his mind, he thinks, this it just cheated on me. Why do you think that she cheats? Uh, just being on the phone for about an hour, talking, talking on the phone to just another man who I always have problems problems out of. Uh, Who's the other guy? Uh, a family friend. That's a family friend, so-called family friend, but uh, but they can stay on the phone talking to Howard. I tried to rush, rush her off the phone and just kind of spend time with her. And, but uh, other than that, other than her talking on the phone, what makes you think she's cheating? Just look at that, man. It's, she's sparkling. Listen, she's, I like to think my wife's really good looking, but I don't look at her like, and say, she's somebody else. She's, yes, <laughs> You ever cheat on her? Never cheated on her. Never. From the bottom of my heart, never cheated on never. her. Never. Never. Are you on uh, dating sites? Uh, no, sir. That's and you know the pop-ups. Just the pop-ups and uh, oh, it shows yeah. the dating what sites. What are the pop-ups? Huh? When you're looking at porn, you see these pop-up yeah. sites? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I... <laughs> <laughs> and when you're looking at this porn, and you're getting aroused by these women, right? No. You don't? No, not, not really. It, Why it do you look at porn, then? It ain't me looking at porn, it's but You I just said look, you were looking at porn. But I do porn. look at porn. So we broke your lie detector test on the two parts, whether you murdered somebody, <laughs> <laughs> and did you cheat on somebody or him? OK, we'll start with the murder first. <laughs> <laughs> We asked you, did you participate in any way in the death of your ex-husband? You answered no. Did you physically cause your ex-husband's death? You answered no. I'd really like to say you failed the test, but <laughs> you passed. You told the truth. Amen. See? So See? I'm, I'm not sorry, a murderer, baby. guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> Heather, you've been accused every day, every, every day. day, for four years, whether you cheated on Joseph. And we asked you, while in a relationship with Joseph, have you had sexual physical contact with any other males? You answered no. While in a relationship with Joseph, have you had sexual intercourse with any other 
males? She answered no. And the results for her lie detector test is that Heather told the truth. Yeah. While in a relationship with Heather, have you had sexual physical contact with any other females? No. You answered no. While in a relationship with Heather, have you had sexual intercourse with any other females? No. You answered no. The results came back the same to each question, and they came back that Joseph did not tell the truth. <laughs> Maybe I promised to God. Why couldn't you tell me before I brought I you on this show? To God. I did not have sex with anybody. I promised to God. Baby, I love you. I have not slept with anyone else since we've been together. It must be. I'm so sorry. Joseph, the best advice I, I can tell you is you need to start stop be lying baby. and be honest like and say honest. who. I'm tell to me who. Out, if you want to keep me, you need to be honest from here on out. Do you understand? No more lies. Was it with, if you're going to do it, it, be was, man enough to admit was it, it. Was it with uh, if Like, you, I can promise, I don't know. Was we dating when, when I was going out? No, we was. I'm talking about since this test was since we moved in together. You got While in a relationship with together. others. Since you've been in a relationship with her. Oh, you've since got, I've been in a relationship you've got with to you. Be, you've got to own up to your You're man enough to do it. Be man enough was to I was admit in, it. Was I was in a relationship with you when I was with I don't know. Was you? I don't know. Heather, that I was wasn't allowed to go time, anywhere, baby. remember? You were following me everywhere because I might do something wrong. But look who was doing something wrong. Man, you. Live tests don't lie. I'm so sorry. Why would you do this to her? I, 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 listen, we do these cheating stories all the time. And, and, you know, when this happens all the time, the person who's cheating accuses, accuses. But this isn't occasionally. You put the poor girl through four years of hell, and she hasn't done a damn thing. We and both you're doing did it. it. We no, both did it together. She, but she didn't do she it. I deserve to accuse you. You was doing this, you cheating bastard. She, she has a right to accuse you because you were cheating. It's the truth. Okay. She didn't cheat on you. I didn't do nothing wrong. I, know, I didn't I deserve I'm all so this. I'm so sorry. What, what happens now? Get the off my stage. You heard her. Get the hell off my stage. Um, so, so when you go back home, what happens? I don't know, Steve. I don't you think know, I should file. I don't think I should file this marriage license because our relationship's been based on nothing but a lie. Well, I don't know. You don't have uh, no idea. I can tell when he when he's cheating. I knew he was. It's not a real big shocker. It is in a way, because I just knew, like, please, God, let it, I just let it be my fairy tale, you know? But it's not, it's not time for my fairy tale, apparently. He but doesn't strike me as a very honest guy. He's not. And he, I can tell when he's cheating, because he'll be hiding his phone and stuff and be all on me about my phone, and I ain't even and, touched and my listen, phone. Listen, all the things he's making excuse about the hookup sites and all this stuff, uh, here's a guy I think, you know, he, I believe he wants you and he's in love with you. I believe that. But he's not only being to you, right? He's not just keeping himself for you. He's, he's out there. And you're really going to have to make a tough decision because, listen, I see the pictures of you and your family, and it's like that's what everybody wants, like you know, the kids, the, 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 the good times. Uh, but it just seems like there's just so much bad things in this relationship that you have to put up with to get a few good times. The good's so great, you know, and I'll cherish those memories forever. But he's not worth the hell I've been put through. No. Not anymore, I'm done. He just officially lost me forever. Right. I'm, I'm really sorry to you got the, the truth that you wanted. I, I, I wish it was different for you, but... Um, you know what? You're a beautiful woman, and you shouldn't have to tolerate that. And I'm sure you'll move on, and you'll be happy with somebody who won't torture you like that. All right. Thank you so much Good for your time. help. <laughs> Thank you.